Hi guys, Sean here with photodeoxpro.com and today I'm going to show you how I made a body cap pinhole lens and captured video like this. Pinhole lenses are the simplest type of lens out there and you can create some pretty engaging lo-fi imagery with them. You can buy a precision made pinhole lens online, but where's the fun in that? Making them yourself is cheap and easy. First, you'll need an extra camera body cap. For this build, we're using our very own PhotoDeox Sony E-mount body cap. Click on the links in the description below to buy your own. You'll also need an aluminum can, a pair of scissors, some fine sandpaper, and some black gaffer tape or duct tape, as well as a sewing needle or push pin, and a black Sharpie or black paint. To begin, make a hole in the center of the body cap. We used a Dremel to make ours, but you can also use a drill. The hole we made is pretty large here, and you can go smaller if you want. Next, take the pair of scissors and cut a circle of aluminum out of the can. Place it on the body cap covering the hole and tape it down, making sure to leave a square in the middle for the pinhole. Take a sewing needle or push pin and make a small hole in the aluminum in the very center of the body cap. Then, use fine sandpaper to clean the edges of the pinhole. You can leave the edges messy if you want for a more lo-fi look. Finally, use a Sharpie or black paint to cover the rear aluminum surface. This will help reduce internal reflection, giving you a less hazy image. When compared with a normal lens, I found the focal length of my pinhole to be about 35 millimeters, which is pretty nice for shooting handheld video and stills. A pinhole lens lets through very little light, so you'll need to shoot at high ISOs if you want to shoot video. I used a Sony A7S for this demo because it can shoot at very high ISOs with beautiful grain-free results. If the pinhole was closer to the sensor and smaller, I could get a wider and sharper image, but I kind of like this blurry lo-fi look. I did try stacking this lens on our Sony macro extension tubes and it does make the focal length longer, which can be useful if you want to zoom in on your subject. I had a ton of fun making this lens, shooting with it, and I love the images I was able to capture. I'm actually thinking about using it on my next short film. It's a horror film, it's going to be black and white, and I love this you know, creepy, moody look that I was able to capture with this, and I think it'll be perfect for the project. If you'd like to do this build yourself, click the links in the description below to get your body cap. Click here to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and click right here to see all of the footage featured in today's video. I'm Sean with Photodeox, and happy shooting!